Bible is clear on the fact that we are not to allow the powers of darkness any breathing space as they are wicked and they won't repent. The Word of God tells us in Ephesians 6, 12 to 18, that we should put on the whole armor of God to effectively have victory over the devil and his cohorts anytime they come against us. As children of God, we are not to labor and at the end of the day, there will be nothing to show for all our efforts. We are blessed, favored and redeemed by the Lord. Our efforts will yield tangible results in the name of Jesus. You are welcome to this channel. If today is your first time, I am adopting you into my prayer circle and I'll be praying for you and your family daily. All you have to do is to stay connected by hitting the subscribe button in red letter and hitting the notification bell so that YouTube reminds you when I drop any of the prayers God places in my heart for you. The Word of God says in Matthew 28 verse 18 that God has given us all authority in heaven and on earth. This means that whatsoever we decree will come to pass. I therefore decree that all of your efforts will yield tangible results in the name of Jesus. I decree that your little efforts to achieve greatness will never go unrewarded in the name of Jesus. I pray over you that you will eat the work of your hands. Premature death would not take you away untimely, thus preventing you from eating your labor. I scatter all the powers of darkness that are plotting how to make you walk like an elephant and eat like an ant in the name of Jesus. I decree over you that you will walk, being a prince that you are, you will ride on horses. By the power of the Holy Ghost, I pronounce judgment of God upon all the enemies that want you to beg before you eat. The Bible says in 2 Thessalonians 3, 3, that God is faithful and he will strengthen you and protect you from the evil ones. I decree over you that God is strengthening you and protecting you from all the evil ones that are bent on frustrating all your efforts in Jesus' name. I pray for you that you would never be an object of mockery to the evil ones in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I decree that the enemies will never rule over you. In the name of Jesus, I come against the spirit of Median that allows you to labor and when you are to harvest what you sow, they will come and steal it away from you. In the name of Jesus, I decree that from today, you will not have wasted labor in all that you set your hands to do. In the name of Jesus. By the power in the name of Jesus, I pray for you that the Lord will rescue you from every attack and will bring you into safety. I pray for you that the good work God has started in you will be completed even unto the day of Christ. No one stops it from manifesting in the name of Jesus. I decree over you that God will manifest his almightiness in all facets of your life. The Bible says in Psalm 121 verse 7 that the Lord will keep you from all evil. He will watch over you. I pray for you that you go about your business. God will watch over you and keep you away from the evil of the day in the name of Jesus. I pray for you that you won't lose your life to the evil ones who want you to wander about like a vagabond. I pray for you that you will never be a tool of the enemies against yourself. In the name of Jesus, I pray for you that you will not lose your means of earning a living. God will always be your source and sustainer. I pray for you that God will give you the ability to overcome all temptations the enemies will send your way to distract and frustrate you. In the name of Jesus, I pray for you that God will give his angels charge over you to keep you in all your ways. I pray for you, God breathes life into your efforts and makes them worthwhile. There is the speed of the Holy Ghost for you in your business and the work of your hands. I pray for you that you gain accelerated promotion in your workplace. I pray for you that you are not fearful of the enemy's antics because God is with you and 
his right hand would uphold you in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I decree that the association of the enemies to make you murmur about your business is scattered. I decree over you that the works of your hands are blessed and there are no losses anymore for you in all you set your hands to do in the name of Jesus. I thank you, Lord, for answering all our prayers. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Amen. Please endeavor to drop your testimonies and your prayer requests in the comment section. God bless you and keep you. Amen.